Hello lovesies, welcome back to my channel. <gasps> Wait, I forgot to change myself. I borrowed it from Hermione, don't judge me. <sighs> now we can start. So today I'm gonna make the cake for Harry Potter's 11th birthday, made by Hagrid. Well, I forgot my one, took me five hours. So I'm using magic today that it doesn't take five hours. I hope you don't have five hours. I messed it up a little bit, you will see. Yeah, let's get into the video and I hope you enjoy. Swish and flick. Harry. Ah. it myself, words and all. <sighs> Thank you. It's not every day your young man turns 11 now, is it? Hey. Oh yeah, and Hagrid used uh, two days. Uh, basically, I had to do it in one because I had no time to use two. But it was a little bit strange, the recipe. So yeah, that's why I think they use magic for sure. So yeah, let's get into the video. Oh, my head is uh, really shrek. First, you make the cream for the inside and put it in the fridge. Step two. You melt the butter for the two layers. Meanwhile, you can already make the other dough. So you need eight eggs, magic. And then you need sugar, you need vanilla sugar, you need a little bit of everything which is on the recipe. I don't remember everything. If the, the butter is melted, then you put in the chocolate and then melting it and leave it there. Like this and then you put a little bit of cream in it and then you mix both together and be careful it's very very uh, wiggly step three is you make the other dough so basically he uses different kind of uh, doughs and mix everything at the end together you can just follow the recipe or use magic like here and then the cake I had to bake two times because I had a small one but use the big one like Hagrid uses because it is too heavy you will see it later now I tried something without magic but it didn't work at all The second now and now I have to cut the top so yeah and the top you take off and then you have one layer you can eat or you can use it like me because the cream was not enough strong like you saw so I put just step five I'm coloring the self-made uh, without magic kind of like dressing <laughs> no pleasure so, and then meanwhile, you can do that. You can just uh, put it on top and you see it's not melting anymore because I put the crumbles inside. And now you have the second, you take off the top again. So you put this on top and then you see it was melting. But because of this, I had five hours. So yeah, uh, now I tried to make the glacier and make the cake really pretty and then I forgot that it's melting so it was really heavy and then it just came out everything and now you see it was wiggling around crazy. Anyway, I messed it up so I had to take the top off and put the bottom into the fridge. everything and then you can start writing so he used two e's and he wrote it wrong a e and i did it also because i wanted to make it original but uh, as you know uh, i did put a little bit too much color inside so it turned pink instead of rose and now i put this one in the fridge so i can um, put everything on top and make the cake hopefully a little bit better than the beginning so it was freezing a little bit it was not frozen it was just cold cold so it holds the top and now, uh, finished. <laughs> 
so that's it for this video oops my camera so yeah away from this that's it for this video i hope you enjoyed make sure to give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and share it with your friends and yeah try to make it at home and maybe a little bit less pink than i did so yeah i'm gonna try it again and then i'm gonna show you probably on instagram or somewhere where i post my stories so yeah uh, thank you so much for watching this video and see you in my next video bye Ooh. Swish and the end. Outro, please.